Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to use Microsoft Excel to convert a percentage grade, a number grade, into a letter grade that you would like to associate that number with. Uh, it's a very handy tool for teachers in their grade books and it does not require very much technical skill whatsoever. So as you can see, uh, I've got a random, random assortment of data here, uh, numbers that range from 50 to 100. Um, next to those numbers, I'm going to have the letter grade that will pop up as soon as we put our grading key into columns D and E. So what we're going to do is, because no one scored less than a 50 uh, in our class, we're going to just put the numbers uh, 50 to 100. And of course, if you did have students that scored less than 50, you would include those numbers in your grading key. You could go even from 0 to 100. All right, next to that number, we're going to then put in our uh, letter grade associated with that range of numbers. So from 50 to 59, that'll be our F range. 60 to 69 will be our Ds. 70 to 79 will be our C range. 80 to 89 will be our B range. And of course, 90 to 100. Oops will be our A's. And if you wanted to include pluses and minuses, you would simply put your minuses uh, in, let's say for the D range, 60, 61, and 62 could be your D minuses, and uh, 67, 68, and 69, your D pluses. You would simply put that in. For time's sake, we're going to go ahead and just leave it with the uh, letter range without the pluses and minuses. The function we're going to be using is called lookup. Uh, basically, we're just going to type in equals lookup, we're going to click the number to the left of our letter grade column. We're going to compare that number to the range of numbers in our grading key. And then we're going to compare that range of number values to a new range of letter grade values, all separated by commas, and we're going to close it off with parentheses. Another thing we need to do is actually fix that column, the grading key, with dollar signs before and after the um, column letter. And all that does is make, make it so that our key will not be moving with us with the uh, number that we're looking up. Alright, go ahead and hit equals and then drag that down. And here we have all of our percentage grades are now associated with the letter grade that the student deserves. Alright, so as you can see, again, not too much technical skill and it's a very handy tool uh, for all teachers that would easily like to convert a number grade into a letter grade. Thanks for watching. Until next time.